So, how deep are we going? Is it deep? We might go deep. All right. They're too smart. They might mess with your hook for fun. Wait, what? Is that a fish? I... Oh, oh, it's a strong one! When it comes to food, Florida is one heck of a mixed bag. So far, I've eaten funnel cake in Disney World, mm. python in the Everglades, uh. and witnessed a pig cooked whole in a Cuban hot box. But today, it's all about the seafood. We usually get about 100 foot visibility out here. I've seen 12 foot tiger sharks right here in hammerheads. Do those kind bite? They don't just bite, they finish the meal. Master seaman Heiko is leading the way. How many rod holders do you have? 32 rod holders, and it's not enough. Doing whatever it takes. Wait, what? We're on. To catch a big. Holy shit. Juicy. Oh, oh it's a strong one. Thumbnail. So will I go from a fisher boy to a fisherman? Or will I float home empty handed? Time to find out what mother nature has in store for us. Argo Conch House. This is the perfect intersection between ocean and breakfast. We're here for the Cracked Conch Eggs Benedict because I have no idea if we're going to catch any fish later. Eggs Benedict with conch. Yeah. Have you had conch before? I've Never. had a conch pistol before. You know what that is? Yeah. Right. I had it on my travel channel pilot. What happens after I eat this? It give you actual boost like a table. Okay, more boost in my roost. Yeah, you got it. More strut in my butt. More pep in your step, more stride in your glide. <laughs> it gives you good stamina. Yup, it's the Bahamian Viagra. This is what your palate would expect from a high-end Michelin star rated restaurant, says Rachel from TripAdvisor. A huge portion of cracked fried conch. Perfectly cooked soft eggs over an English muffin with tomato and hollandaise sauce. Top that with a lobster and conch ceviche. How are they gonna do this? Ceviche mixed with egg and mixed with hollandaise. I'm gonna make sure to get some of the seafoods on here. Scoop it up. Ooh. Whoa. Eggs Benedict will never be the same because it's a little bit sour. It's got yeah. a little ocean mist in there. Mm -hmm. That's what they do. They go to the reef, get some ocean water, and then they just mist it down before they serve it. I'm legally obliged to tell you guys that's not true. <laughs> I haven't had fried conch like this before. My first time. Mmm. We already had like chicken fried steak earlier in this trip. It's like chicken fried conch. Yeah. That's great. It's like bringing together like southern cooking and then stuff yeah. from the ocean. Do you have a YouTube channel? Yeah, so I do have a YouTube channel where I mainly just do catch and cooks. What fascinates people about that niche? I think people like my channel because it's a lot of fails and <laughs> me messing up. And that thing is going straight down, like it went... The reality yep. is it takes a lot of work and perseverance, right? Yep. A lot of the TV shows, they'll go out and film for three days straight and turn it into like a one day fishing episode and you don't even know that it's different days. Well guys, we're not doing that. We're filming one day and yeah. you're gonna see every fail and whatever else we need to make it to 10 minutes in one second. Oh no, the rain is worse. It's much worse. I'm having a lot of fun. This is all for you. We are in the mangroves, but we're about to kick it up a notch and head into the open ocean. Are you ready? I am ready. All right, push your lever. Here we go. Ah! <coughs> you swallow a mosquito? Yeah, I think so. I've got my feet in the mud and you don't Right now we're over sand, that's why it's so nice and blue. I see it up there where it starts to get darker color. Oh, we're getting close. See the from the sky in the moonlight. All right, our destination has been achieved. It's time to start trolling some lures. And you see me come around. Well guys, what you see here, it resembles a fish, but it has vicious hooks inside. You don't put bait, you don't dip it in peanut butter or anything? Nope, we're gonna just toss it right on in. 
Dude, I can't believe how many rod holes you have on this boat. I believe 32 rod holders, and it's not enough. <laughs> and then, what are we waiting for? They're gonna bend and start screaming. From the sky, burn. Hey, stop stealing our fish! I think we should roll up on these people like pirates, right? Yeah, we should steal it. Ah. Come on and set the Ah, we got something. There's we got a fish something. on there. Oh my God, this one's gotta be 50, 60 pounds. Come on, baby. Get it in the net. What that is it? That is a mean looking fish. Look at that mouth. Hey buddy, not a good day, huh? In the Bahamas, a lot of people eat them. Okay. But up here, not many people eat them. We're gonna let this guy go because they actually just put a limit on these guys. Eat well, little friend. Get big and strong so one day I can see you again. Hey, thanks. Good luck. Get bigger. We're on. You got this. No! Okay. You got this. Oh, oh, it's a strong one! Holy sh! Wow, that is a strong one. Keep that Give it up. tip up. Why is it running like that? I don't know. How big is it? Holy crud. <laughs> Oh, smokes. It's so strong, what do I do? Sometimes you just gotta let them do their thing. Man, um, wow. It's not pulling anymore, but right now, it's like it's just on a rock. But at first, I felt it. All right, here I go. All right, buddy, you got this. Right now I can feel him like putting his hand on the line, following it out. All right, he's diving down. Slack, give it some slack. Okay. <laughs> Too much slack. All right, I don't know, it just got really loose. Oh no! We freaking lost it. Oh no. There it is. What a battle. No fish. Can you grab one while you're in there? It seems our luck doesn't lie in the open ocean. Time to change strategy. We are now in protected mangroves. A lot of fish grow up here and then they move offshore when they get bigger. For college? We're gonna anchor up, chum, bait some hooks, and try to get some snapper, maybe even a shark. Keep talking good, keep talking sweet. The chum is the siren song for the snappers. Keep sugar rock, baby. So right now we have three fishing rods set. We've got two here for the snapper, one for a shark. Any moment now, a fish can bite on one of these lines. Oh, something's happening. Get it? Dude. I got you good. Real oh, 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 it's got some fight to it. It's huge. I got you sweet. Got you on hold. Boom, another fish. Yeah. This is what we came here for. Really? My baby knows. Baby knows. Oh, dude, look at those fangs. It looks like a vampire fish. It's pretty good. Oh, snap. Oh, the shark lion. Oh, He's about to jump. Whoa! <laughs> Dude, we got a fucking shark! This is wild! Baby knows, baby knows. That's such a beautiful creature. Yeah, you get a close-up of his skin. It's like that diamond pattern. Wow, feels rough. Is this an endangered shark? No, they're not endangered. If they're, I think, 47 inches long, you can eat them. This is not, not big enough to eat. All right, goodbye, nurse shark. Thanks for being a good sport. Make sure he's feeling good. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> he's good. That's the first time I've encountered like catching a shark like right that. Right after we caught the snapper. Yeah, like, right? Zzz. Hey, nice work. Not bad for my first time out. Heiko and I have decided to celebrate early. This is sashimi here on the mangroves. This is great, dude. He fillets the snapper, cutting thin slices that'll pair with soy sauce and wasabi, two items he always carries on board. What are the rules as far as what fish you can eat raw? 
There are no rules. If you can eat the fish anyway, you can eat it raw. Some fear that eating raw fish could give you parasites, and they're right. So unless it's been frozen beforehand, eat with caution. Look at that, fresh mangrove snapper. Ready? All right. Oh, that's nice. delicious. Mm -hmm. See how it is though a little bit chewier? Mm. But it's still, I mean. I like it, some variation in textures. It doesn't have to be all soft for me. That's good, then this is the perfect platter. <laughs> Does it get any better than this? It's like we're at a free grocery store, except we're at the ocean. But you get the idea. Heiko and I caught like so many more fish, but we didn't want to bore you with all of that. Now we're gonna cook them up for a proper nautical feast. Do you eat a lot of raw fish? Yeah, a pretty good amount of raw fish. Do you check your mercury levels ever? Or? Um, I think if my mercury levels were high, I would feel it, so, <laughs> and I feel fine. Today's menu, mackerel and blackfin tuna sashimi, plus grilled white margate. Heiko shows me a little trick. I'm gonna open his stomach up. Let's see what he's been eating. Oh, jeepers. There is a lot of sand in here because they're wow. picking those crabs off the ground. Listen to the sand, it's so gritty. He was a good eater. That's how he got nice and juicy like this. See? Is that your catchphrase? That's the catchphrase. Oh, we got the catchphrase. That's the catchphrase. Oh, catchphrase, juicy. The Margate is doused with olive oil, black pepper, capers, minced garlic, onion, sliced cherry tomato, and parsley. Wrapped in foil, then set to grill on low heat. From the ocean, we've got fresh sashimi, and then our bait fish, huh? I'll tell you what we caught with this bait fish, my heart. Like that. That was for the ladies. I'm gonna start with the mackerel. Right, I like awesome. your style of cutting. It is rustic and jagged, I would say. Here we go. Got some soy sauce on mm -hmm. there. 100% amazing. That is that so is good. good. Clean, soft, tender sashimi. Man, are you sure your body isn't, your blood stream isn't just coursing with mercury? Because I would be but eating this like every day. If you eat enough of it, it actually makes you stronger at one point. Does the metal detector go off when you go through it? Metal detector always goes off when I go through the <laughs> <laughs> All right, here is the black pin tuna. Oh, it's so good. A little bit different taste than your average tuna. Oh. They're less fatty than your average tuna. Black fin tuna, you can't buy them in restaurants normally because they don't have enough fat for them to freeze. Mm, but it's still tender. Oh yeah. Really soft meat, that's fantastic. All right, we've also got this one here. The white margit. A little bit of fish, a little bit of tomato, a little bit of caper, a little bit of onion. Oh, that is a good bite. The smell here is incredible. Looks soft, tender, flaky. Mmm. That's good. That is great. Just super flaky. It's hard to eat flaky fish with chopsticks. Yeah, that's a tough one. Looks like you got some tin foil here. Mm. Well, you know, that pairs nicely with mercury. <laughs> that was great. Deep sea fishing. It's unpredictable, uncomfortable, unforgiving, and totally worth it. I go. <laughs> What's up? Thank you so much. This was an amazing day. Follow him, South Florida Fishing Channel, on Ooh. YouTube and other social medias as well. I had a lot of fun. We caught a shark. Did you see the part about the shark? From researching and shooting Ooh. to editing and mastering, our 10-person best ever food review show team works hard to roll out the highest quality travel food entertainment twice a week. If you like what we do here, please consider supporting our Patreon. Patreon allows fans of the show to contribute a monthly sum and receive a load of extras like early video releases, private Q&As, and beyond. To learn more about our Patreon, check out the link in the description box down below. And if you can't give or don't even feel like it, that's okay too. <laughs> We're just happy you're here. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time. A peace. peace. All right, let's get to chumming. More chumming time. More chum. We're gonna chum, guys. More chum. This more is, chum. This chum is enough for you. Wah. I saw you when you passed me by, girl. Listen, baby, it ain't a lie, girl. And I, and I can't deny that you sex a little booty caught my eye, girl. Listen, you don't have to be the shy, girl. I'm not a player, you no, know I'm not the guy, girl. Fly up in the sky, a place we could try Yeah, you know that I've been around this time Looking up and down for some to play with Yeah, I know I'm finally found you